Hello everybody, Mike here at Game From Scratch, and a bit of news that will be relevant for game developers, and that is the Epic Games have just acquired Camu. I think I'm saying that right, no idea, K-A-M-U, Finnish company, so how that's actually pronounced, beyond my understanding. But uh, this acquisition is going to probably have some impact down the road. It's, I would imagine a lot of this technology will ultimately be rolled into Unreal Engine at some point in time. That seems to be Epic Games' MO with this kind of stuff. So I don't think that they'll be launching this as a standalone project. I look at this as something that is going to add to the functionality in Unreal Engine. Now, of course, I could be wrong. That's 100% speculation on my behalf. But eh, I just think it works that way. So let's jump right in. Take a look first at the Unreal Engine... Um, announcement and then we'll jump into a little bit of what Camu do. Now you may have never heard of them, I certainly haven't, but I have definitely played games that use their technology as have most likely you as well. Uh, so basically what they said is, today we are pleased to announce, to welcome Camu to the Epic family. Camu is a Helensky based uh, company supporting the live management of player satisfaction, community building and game integrity. And then the game integrity, that's the big part. Basically they're an anti-cheat company who've branched off into doing uh, further game analytics stuff. I found it in 2013, Camu offers a suite of services focusing on game security, game telemetry, and game management. Now, game telemetry basically is that dialed home stuff that we all hate so very much. And game management, that could be pretty broad in terms of what that's defining. But the big thing here is, again, the easy anti-cheat service protects more than 80 games and is installed by over 100 million PC players globally. Uh... Camu's team and tools have been key to building a vibrant Fortnite multiplayer experience that's fair for all players. So it sounds like they integrated this technology into Fortnite. It worked out well. They bought the company. Now, let's keep in mind that Epic Games is absolutely swimming in Fortnite money right now. So doing acquisitions does make sense. Um... So building and launching games today is incredibly challenging, only half the battle. Camus tools for managing live games help developers grow and sustain their games successfully after launch. At Epic, we succeed when developers succeed. Now again, there's nothing specifically here about it being integrated into Unreal Engine, but I really assume it ultimately will be. Now they could have just bought it because it worked very well for Fortnite. They didn't want to pay a licensing fee anymore, but that just doesn't really sound right or sit right with me. So now we're here at Camus website, and the big thing here is their game security stuff. And you're going to see uh, it uses a combination of AI uh, server and local client install to do uh, security. And these are the games that this is basically, and you use, we'll use the dirty word here, the DRM. Or no, actually, I guess anti-cheat and DRM aren't necessarily the same thing. So this is more about to prevent cheating from gamers. And you can see here among the list of games that it's been integrated in, it's pretty extensive. And you've no doubt heard of a number of these titles. Dragon Ball Fighter Z, Far Cry 5, Seven Days to Die, um, Friday the 13th. Uh, we just kind of keep going and going. I'm sure you've heard Pal Paladins. Um, and on it goes. Rust. It, these are all titles you have no doubt heard of. And then, of course, Fortnite is among them. I would actually see Fortnite as I scroll through. So let's go... Yeah, oh, there it is. I'm blind. Uh, For Honor. Like, so this is kind of one of the preeminent anti-cheating softwares out there, as you can see from the uh, AAA titles, is definitely used in today. So that, I think, again, will ultimately be integrated into Unreal Engine. Now, right now, it's uh, a three-part piece. So you've got Cerberus, Easy Anti-Cheat, and Hydra. This is Hydra Client Data Analysis. So um, server-side client anomaly detection engine leverages the power of big data and ma machine learning to uh, identify otherwise unattainable cheat software. We have Cerberus, the real-time gameplay analyzing, an uh, analyzing engine identifying suspicious cheater behavior based on distribution rather than the exact role configurations. And then the anti-cheat, world's best client-side anti-cheat solution, always pushing the bar on active cheat prevention. Uh, so here you can see how it is actually integrated into your game client. I believe right now it is engine agnostic. Uh, we go on back up here. They've also got other tools, developer tool stuff here. So there's gameplay data. Uh, so you see here, they've got, oh, I don't know if it's actually launched yet. But reliable and accurate gameplay analysis, giving real-time insight into how your players enjoy and play your game. And then we've also got Community Connect. And Community Connect, stay on the pulse of your Community Connect to the gamers in-game and beyond, provide a new level of support. So this combination together, so basically they've got tools to prevent cheating, to better connect with your community, and to perform an analytics on how um, your game is actually being used. This combination of tools, it does sound like the perfect complement to extend the Unreal Engine by. So... 
So I expect all of these to be features in Unreal Engine 4.21 or something into the near future. And so I figured I would share it here. Worst case scenario, this is a company that was just bought up by Epic and it goes nowhere, but I highly doubt it's gonna end that way. So what do you think? Do you think we're gonna see anti-cheat software from Camu integrated into Unreal Engine very soon? Let me know, comments down below. All right, talk to you all later, goodbye.